in this JavaScript gaming tutorial, we will add game scoring to a previous project we created in my video, Make a JavaScript Dice Game. All the code you will find at codingcommanders.com slash dice. The high score list that you see, we will not make in this video. We're gonna make it in the next video. I was planning on having the two of them together Together, but last minute decided to separate them. This tutorial is mainly about the JavaScript. I'll also go over the new HTML elements connected with the JavaScript we're gonna write. So I'm just gonna go onto my website and copy style.css to style our game. Then is index.html. Most of the code I went over in my previous tutorial, make a JavaScript dice game. There are some new components related to the JavaScript we're gonna to write today, and I'm just gonna briefly point them out, starting with the game form. It has an ID of my form, so that's how we're gonna identify it. My form also has a text input field for the player to enter their name. Both its name and ID are player underscore name, a read only numerical input field that has a name of player underscore score and an ID of score. At the bottom, my form has a submit button. The game logic was written in the make a dice game tutorial. We just have to add the score variable to hold the score. If the player rolls a lower number than the enemy, then he loses and thus loses a point off of his score. If the enemy rolls a lower number than the player, then the player wins that round and a point is added to his score. And if it's a tie, nothing happens. We are finally ready to use document get element by ID to display the player's score in the input field we made in our HTML document with an ID of score. And we do it by setting the value attribute of that element to score. The end game button isn't going to work at the end of this tutorial, but the next tutorial making the high score list should be out probably next Monday. If not, it will be out the Monday after that. And the code's already up on my website. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel for some more JavaScript gaming fun. Thank you for watching my video. And until next time, Happy coding. My anaconda don't want none unless you know code, hon. <laughs>